Virginia hasn't always been in the same place. Interactions between the Earth's surface and its interior have landed Virginia where it is today. 400 million years ago, Earth's supercontinents were on a collision course with one another. Forces beneath the Earth's surface were driving the movement of these large continental plates. Let's take a closer look at these forces in action. Around 350 million years ago, the oceanic crust of the African plate slid beneath North America's continental crust in a process called subduction. Subduction occurs when two plates collide and the edge of one dives beneath the other. This process allows continents to move towards each other by consuming the intervening ocean crust. At about 280 million years ago, Africa plowed into North America, merging into a supercontinent called Pangaea and forming a collision zone. Both plates resist subduction, and over millions of years, they buckle and are forced upwards to create mountains like the Appalachians. By 230 million years ago, Pangaea began to break apart in the process called rifting. Rifting occurs when a continent literally fractures apart, forming a valley, then a narrow sea, and eventually an ocean. Magma rises into the fracture, forming the crust beneath the new ocean. After Pangaea broke apart, North America and Eurasia were separated from Africa by the growing Atlantic Ocean. North America and Europe then rifted apart, and the continents drifted into their present orientation. Continental drift isn't just a thing of the past. Even today, all around us, there is rifting, subduction, and collision taking place on our dynamic, living planet that we call Earth.